All right, brothers, celebrity celebrities, and welcome. This is the Sim Pit. I'm Devin Booth, and we're racing ourselves the Sim Pit Road Series. We're here in the GT1 cars. I'm in the Aston Martin. There's Corvettes afoot as well. We're at Road America. Oh. Looking at our leaderboards for this one, we have Dave Grunnell in first with a 201 506. Second place is Randall White with a 201 right, 639. Thomas Dudek in GT1 third with a 201 786. Season, and I'm going to shut up and let Sean talk because he started now. Again, please, <laughs> everyone remember these GT1 cars are really, really tough on cold tires we are using that 10x rule if you didn't get the email today it is official 10 nice x paint equals roger drive through penalties stop and go nice paint and your second 10x will result in a second stop and go Straight so please beauty, observe mate. those rules in addition to that our fuel is capped at 18.6 gallons so no matter what your setup make sure you load the right race setup make sure you have it with your <laughs> good luck brother fuel plan Take it easy on those opening laps. Again, the braking on these on cold tires is tremendously difficult. Turn in. A lot of oversteer. A lot of people going around. Keep your heads up for cars ahead. Spun out. Keep ahead for people. Keep your head, eyes ahead for people checking up. And be safe and have a good time, you guys. Sean, can I get a black fly cleared? <laughs> Take that first turn. Oh my god, the lights went green. I can't help it. Oh, shh. <laughs> that was fast. Oh, oh my god. god. Left. Take it easy. Careful, car on your left. Careful, still there. Bottom of the hill is going to be really scary, too. I'm not racing for a while. Oh, unless Mark gets near me. Fuck that. <laughs> oh, push up. <laughs> <laughs> uh, easy car on your left. Hold your line. All right, I already have 10 for the stream. Oh, Mark checked out. This All is right. where it gets Still dangerous there. right here. Hold your line. All clear on the left. You start's okay. We can build something from this. Oh. Incident 10, 10, 5. All right. Still there. <laughs> Wow! Oh, someone's going the wrong way. Caution, caution, caution. Bumper! I see a bumper. <laughs> that can't be good. I'm definitely missing chat, guys. Well, I'm I wasn't sorry. nervous till that happened. Now I am. Yeah, sorry whoever got me. Um, you got loose. Came right across my front. Uh-oh, Mark. Hold on to it. Whoa. Oh shit. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Heads up, heads up, no, no, no. Oh, oh. why did they go to the brake? Oh. 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 Why did it was so Your wheel is rolling down the track? Oh shit! <laughs> oh, oh. he was stopping and he let go of the brake. I'm like, no! I'm about to hit your wheel. Damn. Now let go of the brake to hit the gas to get off the track. It's all good. It's all good. You got fast repairs. You know, yeah. a lot of mistakes would be made. So. Okay. It wasn't, wasn't to too fun. bad. It didn't sound malicious either. It sounded like honest to god cold tires. I can't even figure out which one's my uh, pit limit. Oh, there it is. <laughs> oh, turn so fast. Must mush them all. Do <laughs> to drive it in on three wheels? Yeah. Maybe you should try oh, using shit. a couple rims instead of 30. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, now, now I'm on. I can't stop. Oh, stop. <laughs> You're in this guy in the gaps now. Don't win two. Carnage, carnage, carnage. Yellow flag. I got concerned. Uh, 
Alright, I'm not that far behind. Nah, you'll be alright. Oh, cool, cool. Focus. I was focused, I just didn't do the right thing. That was a mistake. There's an incident in Canada Corner. We think it might be Wagner. Oh, carnage! Incident in turn 14. Oh, shit. I ain't gonna lie, I'm happy when I hear you say that right now. <laughs> yeah, I'm saying it so people know there's a car <laughs> in the spot you should heads up for. Trying, Neil, I'm trying. Right on, Tyler. If I'm not mistaken, the GT1s are the fastest of all of the GT flavors, but they are actually, in my opinion, easily the hardest to drive. Oh yeah, so, they try to kill you. Yeah, when you use a word like better, um, now in iRacing they have a GT3 and a GT1, not a GT2. They now have a GT4. The Ford is a GT2. What's that? The Ford is a GT2. The one that oh, runs the, the series. The Ford GT? Yeah. The lonely Ford GT? Yeah, there Conic. is one. <laughs> Looks like P6 has gone off in turn 6. Sorry, it's really hard to watch chat. This car is not easy to drive. And hey, Michael, how you doing, bud? We're still in traffic here. No mistakes. <laughs> well, late, late, late. Go ahead, you got it. The leader's just done it. 201.5. I got Andrew and Jason both on the big comeback. Mother. On your left. Whoa, don't do that, Cole. Oh, you dummy, dummy. Now you got to observe them when you come back on. See? 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 That's how you do that. No problem, no panic. Now let's get back to work. Oh, okay, Gabby. So easy to do in this car. Left side. Ah, oh, come on, let's go. Oh, left side. Now I got a lot. Well, that got fucking spicy. Woo! Yeah. <laughs> Calls the meat in the sandwich. Oh, okay. For some reason, roast beef comes to mind. All right, they're on your right. <laughs> On your right. All clear on the right. Who's slinging the horse rash sauce? <laughs> I love horse rash. Nothing like some army's roast beef, some horsey sauce. Car on your right. Hold your line. Come on, David, go! <laughs> Still there. At a run. Oh, you tear touching. Still there. You're on your right. Oh, dreams. Oh. Oh, shh. I wouldn't have there yet, Dad. <sighs> James was a little slow and not able to hold the inside. He pushed poor Doug off there, I think that was. Oh, and another person. I think James is getting a little bit uh, nervous, I think. <laughs> Wayne's like, not, I'm not doing that with you again. Don't worry, I got it there too. Thank you, Wayne. Good job, Tyler. The guy ahead is um, Roberts, the right 
Yes, Neo, my monitors are not the same size. I have a... Just make sure your two side ones are the same size. If possible, the same monitor. And that's what matters. Like, my middle is a 27 and I've got two 24s. It just... The more offset they are, the weirder they're gonna look. My black flags are good, but how about a caution? <laughs> Shut your ass, Tyler. <laughs> Thanks, Ty. You'll move up a spot when I return. GG on the triples, buddy. Oh, she is sloppy, George. You gotta really tiptoe. fun when you get it dialed in and used to it though it's a really cool George car. is that a sandman uh I hold on <coughs> coast us uh, had to check we haven't seen a sandman in a long time you're still welcome to George don't worry <laughs> <laughs> now George is Hi, a regular George. sandman just did that really good in that racing series so I was hoping we would chat to him at some yeah. point he did. Uh, Red, Red Man. Slip and slaps, brother. Uh, I did last night. I was killed. I was very, very, very happy. Uh, very sad. Very, 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 very sad guy. I was killed. And then I was extra angry. And when I get angry, I don't race well. As evidenced by my dying two laps later. All right, come on. Stay on that draft or you're gonna just become no man's land. I don't like no man's land. Remember not where the work was from tires as well. Yeah, I mean I could I should have not pushed. You know, like I could have waited and probably that would have been a little easier. That brake lockup you just heard, which we survived that time. But next time, if we do that again right now, we're just gonna start heating them up, and that would be very bad. It's not how you're gonna catch them. You're a strange noise. I'm in GT4 this year, and I'm excited for it. It's been a lot of fun so far. It's hard, but fun. And I didn't have a lot of practice for this one, so I kind of knew this one wasn't going to be as good. Pass left. Hey, George. Thank you, buddy. Awesome. Thank you, man. You're welcome. Sense racing for something hard. I can't hold. If I can learn to go That's faster scary. now, maybe get a little draft. That would, in the long run, be more beneficial. All of a sudden, Andrew's car is <laughs> a jiffy pop. No, oh, I got a little screen blip there that was 
I'm guessing through from the Elgato. We're just getting all sorts of shit thrown out. Oh, 20 push-ups. I like how the grass is getting worn off the inside of the apexes. Getting a little slidey already. Yep, me too. <laughs> I hear you, Stern. Yeah, that kind of stuff slows everything down right now. I was late, though, so in all fairness, you're okay. Well, how much fuel do you think we're going to need on a pit? Eight, eight gallons. gallons. Oh, you're, you're one of the metric folks. So oh. eight times four is 32. The lap time was at 203.6. I like how he can switch between gallons and metric while he's driving. Yeah. I do pints as well. I'd have to pit for that kind of decisions. <laughs> it's not rocket surgery. Especially for pints. It's not rocket fucking surgery. There's four liters in a gallon. Yeah, that's because you're Canadian. Yeah. <laughs> 568 milliliters <laughs> is a pint. We get stuck at the fact that you get a bigger number. We're like, what? That's all wrong. <laughs> it's like the first time you see it. You get kilometers. Well, maybe you should have used <laughs> freedom meters instead. It's like the first time you see a metric uh, speed limit. You're like, 80? Let's go like hell. <laughs> <laughs> You'd be fucking driving right quick at 110 down the fucking highway then. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> so he says I've got eight laps left. Just come. Whoa, we got a little kick out there on her early downshift, I believe, was the problem. We're running pretty slow. We're just kind of cruising right now. It is a nasty car, George. At Sebring, I can just imagine what a nightmare. I, I, I'm sure we're running Sebring this season. It was actually we nice at Sebring. For it. Put all the dampening down to zero and send it. I'm running an asymmetrical setup. I did. See, I'm not sure send it is the right motor uh, automotive motorsport reference. Isn't that like about like, ah, who gives a shit? Just send, oh, 30 push-ups. Just send it off the jump. Isn't mm -hmm. that No, nah, Randy, nope. Randy sends it everywhere. It's not just off the jump. It's not just on a snowmobile. It might be in a golf cart. It might be in a car. It might be into a bush of cacti. Doesn't matter. Day's nice, Welcome day's bad. Check, just send it. No, that didn't come from send it. That's a Canadian dude named Randy, and he's the shit. Phil kind of sends it into turn one usually. Well, that's a problem. All the send it. Oh, what the fuck are... over is going on here? What the lap car let me go and then just what the fuck? That sucks, Devin. I narrowly missed that. On your left. Yeah, I got damage. Clear on the left side. Yeah. Down there. I'd rather miss a downshift than throw an extra downshift. That's for sure. Wasted does say. Still gonna send it. Quick repair when I fuel. Oh, Tom, I don't think the wind's happening today. We're running eighth, and I got nothing for the two guys ahead of me. I'm just tracking them. It stopped strategy. <laughs> oh. The gap in front has increased. It's now about 1.0. So we've done 10 minutes. 20 minutes of racing, roughly. 
I mean, I've been I running behind go. Andrew long enough. I might worry about overheating soon. I don't know. <laughs> Another 15 laps in. Larry. Thank you. Thank you, Racer. Curly. Ramirez behind us now. 5.5. V12. Come on, man. Stop fucking it up. Two I spots. Did fuck it up and think I'll take two. Probably Honestly, when it boys. started, I thought a uh, top 10 was going to be quite a challenge, so I'm happy if we could bring it home here. I'll be thrilled, but the game is far from over. We all have to pit still. I was managing yeah, to keep up with our until that damn incident. Mm -hmm. Ah, oh, that corner's getting worse and worse. So we're thinking there's about 25 liters and uh, 25 laps in this race. So I need about another 10 liters of fuel. So let's say 10, 15 laps. Fuck, I don't have any smokes over here. Oh, Doug's gone. I'm in a fuel for 28 laps. Whoa. Lap 11, car's starting to feel good. Yeah, your setup was a little tight. I thought. <laughs> was it really stern? I had higher hopes for it than that. I really did. Not late, late. You got 10 seconds to Ken. Canada 
Alright, Devin, you're reeling this guy in. The gap's now 2.3 seconds. He's slower than us into turn 5, P18. Tire is just starting to operate a little. I'm rolling in, running low to up. What a mad lad you are. Thanks, James. No problem. Just pit, Ken. Get your fuel while you're slow, brother. Okay, Devin. There's a car I had to do it too. No shame. You should be able to make it now. Keep digging. This isn't over yet. 16th place. Laps to fill. Right, the guy ahead of us is Clark. Nice save there, Roger. It's the paint climber. It saves him. Could have killed us both, pretty. But he took one for the team. My God, this pit lane is forever long. <laughs> Could be worse. Could be Spa endurance layout. That's true. <laughs> it just felt longer than it was. What she said. That's right. Giggity. What I'm shooting for. Then you're doing it right. That's because you told her it was longer than it was. You used kilometers. Yeah. 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 <laughs> That's right. It's European size. You know when the metric system gets down to the lower ends, it's the other way around, right? Yeah. I just want you to know, I think I was going to make that mistake with or without Andrew. <laughs> there might have been one tenth extra stab on the brake out of panic, but I was already feeling nosy. <laughs> I'm going to pick next up. Thank you, sir. There. We're only really using all the track here. Oh, Brandon's pit. He's six seconds ahead now. Thank 
Right? Use all of it. Yeah, this car, I don't know, he just gave up a lot of time with that. Damn. Yep. Yeah, even worse. You see my driving skill there? There's an incident in turn eight. <laughs> yeah, I was about to let you pass. I was about to gain on you, but... Got full race mode there. Oh. Yeah, Amir! What the hell, dude? Everybody yell at Amir now. He's scared of the car. Pussy. Captain Amir is behind. It's now 5.4. What happened, dude? Ah. Uh... Yeah, you, the Europeans' times changed today, didn't they? I'm fucking digging this track map, dude. It's pretty cool. See that Grunnell's at the straight now? He'll be pitting. I will do, Amir. Will do. Yeah, I needed running to the back here. Good call. Didn't like the car. Sorry. You can answer some questions. Apologize. Today would have been a good day to turn the fan on. Woo, he's getting hot. <laughs> Going. That's what I did too. Oh, I get all the feedback. It's a boat. Feels like the ocean. This is the closest thing in iRacing to the 97 Chevy Lumina that I love so much. If only the Lumina was rear wheel drive. But then it would be a Monte Carlo. Yeah, Jason got us on the pit. That's okay. They're gonna be okay. close. Increased. It's now about 2.6 seconds. <laughs> no, stay. Very true. Okay. Very true, Wasted. Very true. <laughs> <laughs> I have I love that Hoster. I have him here, yeah. I think it's on the uh, on the standings on the left there. You can see that I've hit as well. I think it'll tell you what lap. How do you like the new layout, Amir? Very fun car to drive, yes. Much rewarding. I just need to get the right boxes for it now, Amir. Once we're settled on our overlays. Hell yeah, Merc. Fuck me. That's twice that I've slid there, but only once that I haven't caught it, so. Fitty fitty, let's go. <laughs> Nice 
I really like this one, Wasted. Whoa. Thank you. Um, but I can make it a little bit bigger. I had some of the stuff I noticed was a little small, like the uh, the estimated laps and the tire temps. I don't know. I don't know the answer to that question. Fourteenth. But I really like the. Uh, the whole track map, everything, it's all there. Because I'm actually using it for me, too, because of where I put the, okay, the camera. I can't see my dashboard anymore, so I was like, well, I'll just put one of these up. Yeah, I'm really happy with it. Between this and my lights, pretty much all the info I need. Relatives there, if I need it. Yeah, Rhea's getting a little loose. Uh, I just slid the whole corner. But yeah, I can make it a little bit bigger. I didn't want to go too large because I thought it would take up too much space. But I do agree that some of the text is small, so I'll try to get it a little bit larger without being too intrusive. Oh, and again. I need to mount one wasted, um, Ooh, which by the way, cold sweat. <laughs> uh, once I have my actual wheelbase, about four I gotta look into how to do it, I don't, or if there's even already kits for it. But I, I'd like to commission you to 3D print me a a phone holder for the DD once I got it all set up. And I know where I need it and all that kind of stuff, you know. I was thinking about asking for one yeah, for the Thrustmaster, but I'm getting the other wheel so soon, and there's just no sense in doing that, right? I'm all home, baby. Sweet, Amir, I'll do that. <clears throat> I told you I was on a time with you yesterday. Just because I can do it doesn't mean that it doesn't compromise me massively at times. Oh, bad run off the corner. Here comes Jason. If you remember the brand, go look at them. There's three of them. It's the center one. Not the best one, not the worst one, the middle one. And then you can see the exact unit. Which I think makes it basically the same as what you have, right? Ugh. It's a little less power, but... Thank you, Amir. We're trying. Still a fuck ton load of power, way more than I need. One thing I definitely want to do is keeping it under you. Okay, you're a boss way to I appreciate it, brother. How fast you are. Whoa, speaking of which, come on. They're all figured out. I like that kind of stuff because it's so cheap to ship. Like, you're in Canada too, so we can actually facilitate shit much easier. I'm sure she's sink a lot in this. printed me out a, a dealio. Oh, that, was, that was presumptuous right there. 
Thank you, Devin. Sorry, James, man. My car yep, now show me the way. Does it just go underneath the wheelbase? The gap in front has increased to 2.0 seconds. All right, Devin, five minutes to go, five minutes left. <laughs> oh, that sucks, I'm here. Hey, where'd Skinner go? <laughs> Brandon? Yeah. Where'd you go? What, uh, what do you mean, where'd what, I go? What position are you in? Eight. Oh, okay, good job, good job. I, was, I didn't see you on my relative and I got worried. No, <laughs> I got sorry. scared for you. Good job, well done, dude. I pitted a couple laps earlier, I think, than most. Yeah, you, I pitted like right after that incident with the lap car, so I pit super early, and I was catching you, and then all of a sudden you were yeah. gone because I made another whoopsie. <laughs> yeah. KC, this is Chinelli Cork Ribbon for a bicycle. IRB! Slabby Slabby's brother, hope you're well. made of cork. See Aston Martin GT1. The ladies bicycle. Huh? What? Oh, ah, that makes sense, kid. Wasted. That makes sense. So it comes That's out underneath all the it, pros use. and then it has like a hole for the. Uh, he calls it orange, but it's really pink. The uh, what'd you do? <laughs> what, about, what about like hockey stick? The pink? steering shaft. That stuff gets sticky. And then you just like oh, yeah, slide it, it over the steering shaft and bolt it through the holes. So does tennis uh, wrap. From what I remember, though, isn't like road bike handlebar super thick? It, it is a touch thicker, but I'm going to wrap it with fewer turns next time. I hear you. I have a lot of overlap. I was thinking just like an L with a circle in it. You just like slide it there. Uh, okay. Golf? Isn't golf like a one-piece handle? No, it's got a wrap on it. I think it's about the same as the... Uh, Tennis. It, it maybe it's a little thinner. Uh-oh. I'm at 9x. Better be careful. Doing well, brother, doing well. No, I'm pretty sure my Callaways have a one piece. It depends on the gloves, or it depends on the clubs. Some of them have a one piece. Like the way I name drop my clubs. I did, that's what I was just thinking. I know, I know it's Callaway. Hey, any of you guys, guys got any gray Poupon, please? No Hey, I'm poor and I have a Callaway hybridized. We only drink Earl Grey. <laughs> that way when I stick it up my ass, it doesn't come unraveled. <laughs> oh, Jesus oh, God. Well, we did Why talk about Kyler and Butt Talk. <laughs> Jason, we are doing 45 minute time lap, time race, and it should be actually pretty close to the end Thanks, at Will. this point, I would think. I'm saying 220. I've only got 3.7 laps of fuel left. Oh, I only got 2.6. What the hell? How did that happen? That'd be about right. Well, sorry. You might be a little short climber. How you should only happen? have two laps left now. Two minutes to go. Two minutes. Savage, Slavity's brother. Um, this particular wheel rim was very uh, skinny, and the padding was really a little brutal. It was a little hard. You mean it wasn't hard padded because it's Duramold? <laughs> right? That's the, the uh, yeah. Formula one? Yeah, that one's just, yeah. It's just Duramold. So it desperately needed something, but I wrapped it and it came out a little too thick. But my turns are like 40%, 60% overlap and I could get it to like 40%, 30% overlap, and it would probably be a little better. Certainly out of the cushion, it's squishy now. I like that. There's an incident in turn eight. Hey, Dave, did it's you like get the Ramirez. white flag that time? Watch out. Yeah. Oh, thank God. Careful, car on your left. Clear left. 
Uh, Timmy Hill one, huh? That's awesome. Twenty four inch screen and office chair. That's badass. Yeah, I'll, I'll send you the phone model so that you can have the same sizing. I'd imagine it has to be the right size. But yeah, I'll take a look. Thank you again, Phil. I really appreciate it, buddy. If you guys don't know, Phil's being an absolute wasted boss. Doing, uh... He's making his first formula rim, and when he's done and goes to make a better one, I'm going <laughs> to buy his first one. Woo! Just going to make it. I'm just gonna back it down now because I've made mistakes this track even on the last lap even with a significant uh, margin over next position so we are just gonna try to bring it home but you know never tell a driver to back it down bad things happen no, I make mistakes if I drive slow <laughs> yeah I don't know how to do that if, if I'm not driving flat last lap Tom I'm, I'm fucking holding this uh, shit <laughs> That's how I maintain my consistency. No, it isn't. <laughs> I can't back off on make mistakes. Yeah, you just miss your timing's off. Yeah, yeah. But there are certain corners I can definitely be a little more cautious on. Or on your right. Like the downhill corner. Your They're on your right. Well, well, I went from the second gear to make it the right. right. As I could, so that when you downshifted, it wasn't too bad for the. It was a valiant effort, really. Tom. Yep. <laughs> this last lap, I had to defend this one. All right, I'm happy with fifth. I am happy with fifth place today. Very happy with fifth place. Yep. <laughs> all right, all right. <laughs> One speed, K. <laughs> One speed, full send. That's it. We can see our fuel real quick. Yeah, see what we did finish with. Six. You make sure you hold those last couple corners. I'm coming, Ramirez. I actually finished with three gallons, <laughs> so we could have we could have uh, reduced. We'll have to make a note of that. Oh yeah. Jason beat us in the pit, going with less fuel. Two laps left. Yeah, yeah so we could have went with eight gallon mm. instead of nine. Yeah. Great run there, Grunnel. Thank you, sir. All right. All right. Thank, you. Thank you, Jason. I feel, yeah, I started in 13th, so I feel really, really good about that. Was not feeling strong when we came into the room. Was not feeling strong in practice or qualifying. And uh, just, you know what? It was, uh, it was that Friday night truck racing, long game. That was a long game race from the very beginning. It was a matter of just keeping the tires under us, trying to not hurt the car, trying not to pile up one axes, trying not to lock up the brakes. I wasn't worried about fuel, I was just worried about tires. So with that, we still finished 45 seconds back of our leader, David Grunnell. David Grunnell back. Okay. I've shared my setup, guys. Trophies for Dave. In the room. Sh set up Ooh, shared after the race. Yeah. Hell yeah. I'm gonna that for future, though. I I'm no dummy. Um, it's an asymmetrical setup. Yeah, it's not yeah. going to work for anywhere but here. I like how you said insta wins. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That must be for the vet. That's in there. Yeah. <laughs> yes, sir. It's the Chevy, whatever it is. All right, so back to uh, that. David Grunnell wins the weight race. Randall White finishing in second. Joa Antonio finishing in third. Chris Generali finishing in fourth, and that Sean Cole guy in fifth. Anthony Murano Jr., Brandon Skinner, Andrew Leach, David Clymer, and Jason Gada are our top ten for race number one in our ten-week race. There is one drop in the season, so take your worst event, and it won't count against you. But uh, incredible racing. You can see the challenge. You can see how competitive it is. And I think once everybody comes to terms or comes to grip with this car, uh, we're gonna have some really terrific racing this season. It's gonna take stepping up. It's gonna take some practice It's gonna take Confidence <laughs> that that too in fact uh, Anyway, really fun great job David Grunnell, Randall White, Joe Antonio Congratulations to our sexy finisher. Joa Thank you, Thank you. Slipping on the podium I like to say I did that naked too <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh, yeah, Marquise, these cars are tricky, but they're really rewarding. Uh, it's one of those trickies where, yes, they are hard to drive. One of the hardest cars I've driven in a long time in a road racing series. And yet, it drives fun. Uh, you just got to get tires up to temp, and you got to be really gentle. That's the thing. This is a car that's going to teach people some real driving skill. You uh, learn how to get the throttle on right coming off the corner, you can pretty much do it in anything. You Enjoy. learn to get the braking and even more importantly trail braking right in these cars, you could trail brake anything. It is definitely one of those kind of cars, one of the most difficult cars I've driven in a long time, but very rewarding, very fun, and... Uh, this be a good training session for me then. Yeah, Chris, I was, I was struggling today, didn't get enough prep time. Hell yeah, bros. Oh. With that, we still finished fifth, though, so I should shut up with that. Yeah, I said I was going to get I'll top 15, and I got it. I'm happy. So, well, 27 so drivers. The, uh, 